Today, I'm going to show you how to build a simple yet powerful infrared security alarm circuit that can be used for multiple security applications. Let's begin step by step. First, this is an infrared receiver, IR sensor. I will carefully bend its two pins for better alignment. Next, I'll cut the positive pin slightly shorter to make it more manageable. Apply a thin layer of solder on the pins for proper connectivity, and then attach a 1 kilo ohm resistor to it. The resistor plays a very important role. It helps limit the current so the circuit runs safely and smoothly without damaging the components. Now let's move to the infrared transmitter, IR LED. I'll bend both of its pins as well and cut the negative pin short so it can connect easily. Then I'll solder this negative pin directly to the resistor that we already connected. The transmitter will continuously emit an invisible IR beam, acting like a hidden laser line that only the receiver can detect. Next step is to properly align both components. I'll bend the negative pin of the receiver and the positive pin of the transmitter so they can be placed exactly opposite to each other. This alignment ensures the IR beam directly falls on the receiver. Now let's add the buzzer. I'll bend its pins and connect the negative pin of the buzzer to the negative pin of the infrared receiver. Then I'll solder the positive pin of the buzzer to the positive pin of the infrared transmitter. This connection makes the buzzer respond instantly whenever the IR beam is interrupted. It's time to power up the circuit. I'll take a 3.7 volt rechargeable battery, solder its negative wire to the positive pin of the infrared receiver, and the positive wire to the positive pin of the transmitter. This closes the circuit and supplies the necessary voltage to keep everything running. As soon as I connect the battery, the buzzer starts buzzing continuously. That's because the infrared receiver is detecting the beam from the transmitter and keeping the circuit active. But now, watch this carefully. When I place a simple piece of card or any obstacle between the IR transmitter and receiver, the beam is blocked and the buzzer instantly stops buzzing. The system becomes silent. The moment I remove the card, the buzzer turns on again. This circuit works on the principle of infrared beam interruption. The transmitter continuously sends invisible IR light to the receiver. As long as the receiver detects the light, the circuit remains active and the buzzer sounds. The moment something blocks the path, the receiver no longer detects the beam and the buzzer stops. This circuit has multiple uses, like as a door security alarm system or as a home security system to protect windows, cupboards, or restricted areas. You can also use it as a laser or invisible tripwire security system for small DIY projects even as a fun science project to demonstrate how infrared sensors and security alarms work. Imagine setting this up in your room or at your door, and you'll instantly know if someone tries to pass by without permission. This is a simple but very effective way of making your own mini security alarm system at home.